While Kim Zolciak and Croy Bierman take jabs at each other in divorce court, they're keeping it cordial in front of their kids, and E.T. has the proof. I mean, it's drama. Well, not on Sunday, when they were spotted just a few feet away from each other, attending church with their four children. Croy Jr., Cash, and twins Kaya and Kane, with the whole fam hitting up a local bakery after the service. A lot has changed. We've learned Kim and Croy have actually put on a united front for some time. A source telling us it wasn't like that behind closed doors back in May, the same month they filed for divorce after 11 years of marriage. And you know, sometimes fame and money do change people, but it, God can take it from you as quick as he gave it to you. Meanwhile, the Real Housewives of Atlanta star and former NFL pro face another problem. Allegations of unpaid bills. I hate all show and no go. I hate fronting and stunting. Pay your f***ing bills. That's all I have to say. Pay your f***ing bills. Yeah, fellow Bravo celebrity Bethany Frankels chimed in on the couple's ongoing legal saga. People call me a gold digger, but they just want what I have. Being married to a football player is not always easy. The family's day out comes two months after Kim filed papers demanding Croy be drug tested. E.T.'s also obtained court docs that he's filed, requesting Kim undergo a psychological evaluation for underlying mental issues, including narcissistic personality disorder. Croy and I are the king and queen of this house. I definitely, to be honest with you, always, I always want to be famous. Croy has also claimed that Kim is a compulsive gambler, which became so consuming that, quote, she is unable to properly care for the children, and they are now left financially devastated. Why does this noise make my heart beat so fast? <laughs> These are shocking updates for longtime fans of the Bravo stars, who landed their own reality series, Don't Be Tardy, just two years after their meet cute was captured by Housewives cameras. Can I just be honest with you? I've never in my whole life seen an ass like that. Yeah. We were all sitting at the table. I was like, 10, 10. <laughs> I just had to tell you. Do I think he'll call me? Duh. Would you call me? Kim left the franchise after five seasons, but amid the couple's mounting legal problems, the OG Peach holders were turning with a cameo in season 15. Don't be tardy for the party. Yeah. All in all, this is kind of where I've always wanted to be. Maybe not a reality show, but television in general. It's, it makes me happy, it's fun. It's just trying to keep balance and go to bed at night knowing that no matter what's portrayed on the show, I know who I am.